Record USA, Mark Huntsman, here today to discuss fire alarms and how they can integrate with your swing door operators. Uh, when a fire alarm is triggered, all swing doors, even automatic ones, must shut and self-close positively latch. Okay, so for us to accomplish that, we have an input on our control. It's terminals 14 and 15. When it comes from the factory, as you can see on a close up here, 14 and 15 will have a jumper put into them. Okay, so 14 and 15 will have a closed contact. That's what's needed from your fire alarm input. Put the fire alarm input on 14 and 15, as long as it's closed, the door will run. It won't have any problems. As soon as that fire alarm input is opened up, that door will become self-closing and positively latching if you have done your mechanical install properly. So for mechanical install, you need to make sure that the spring is adjusted so that the door closes without power. And you need to make sure that the um, sweeps and hinges, things like that, don't have binds that would require the door uh, not to close. So if all's done well on your mechanical install, you tie that closed contact to 1415, door works like an automatic door until it's receiving that fire alarm signal. It opens the contact between 14 and 15 and your door will now be a self-closing positive latching door that will meet your NFPA 80 uh, standards and um, all will be well in the world. We um, hope that these videos are helping. Uh, if you have any ideas, please shoot them out. Again, we appreciate what you guys are doing in the field and we thank you for that. Have a great day.